almost didn't come to Monkey Forest because there's so many stories about monkey attacks and having to get treated for rabies and all sorts of things, but monkeys are also really cute. So we're here sharing our experience at Monkey Forest so you can decide whether or not you want to come yourself. Well, the first thing I have to admit is we are definitely not alone here. I haven't seen this many mopeds anywhere. Oh my goodness. Definitely not off the beaten path, but if everyone's here, then I guess that means you have to do it during your trip. Two hundred thousand? A hundred thousand per person? How much is that? Seven dollars fifty? I don't know. Ah, who do they think they are? <laughs> That's not a lot of money, but it is a lot of money here in Bali. So yeah, nothing has cost that much so far. One of the problems that's notorious here at Monkey Forest is that the monkeys actually like to take your stuff. So if you're holding your phone out or your camera, or by God, any sort of food or really anything, they will grab it. So they were telling us like to keep everything in your backpack. Don't bring any sort of food in. Don't look them in the eye. Everyone's staring up here and I can tell why there's baby monkeys. Trying he's, to, trying to zipper. he's trying to chew on your zipper. He's like, it's a zipper. Come here. Good monkey. Good monkey. Oh, he wants it, Holly? I found a monkey. <laughs> he's looking for snacks. Oh my god. <laughs> So far, this has been way better than expected. I thought the monkeys would be like 10 feet away at closest. They're literally climbing on us. This is amazing. Is he trying to eat your shirt? Yeah, I'm trying not to look at it. Yeah. <laughs> He's chewing on your shirt. He's like all mine. I mean, I would want the whole coconut to myself too. <laughs> hey, hello. Don't be frightened, it's okay. This is so cute. He looks very happy. You can call me the man with the yellow hat. It's starting to get dark because we've been here for a few hours now. Time literally flies by when you're here. I've had so many monkeys with their little hands inside my shirt looking for little pieces of food. It's so adorable. Definitely empty out every single pocket and crevice of everything before you come. But this is incredible. So, so many blogs online. Basically, they only talk about the bad experiences, but there's so many people who come through here, which makes sense why there are like instances. <laughs> but you just have to follow the rules, like don't look them in the eye, don't have anything on you, and kind of let them come to you instead of like approaching them. Just sit down and then they'll like come over and like look in your pockets and stuff. But they're so cute and they're really so nice. I think we were really nervous walking in like, trying to keep a lot of distance, but you don't have to stay that far away. You learn as you go through the area that they're really pretty chill. You just have to not threaten them. Definitely bring the bug spray. <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah. I don't even want to count my mosquito bites, but a lot. So you can see monkeys in other parts of Bali. We yeah. actually started in a place called Uluwatu and monkeys were actually everywhere. Like coming into our hotel room, actually problematic. <laughs> there were several breakfasts where food was literally yeah. stolen off of our plates. Yeah, but it's definitely nothing like this. We didn't get to get as close to them. And here we saw so many babies. So many babies. Oh my gosh, there's nothing better than a baby monkey. So you have to come here for 
that really close up experience, seeing them eat and interact and fight and mate and <laughs> all the things that monkeys do. And it's weird because you'll start to notice like little things about them and then you'll recognize. Like we saw one monkey like literally eight different times. <laughs> Lucas almost died. I just got almost attacked by we a monkey. To, we might have to revise our whole review of this place. <laughs> they certainly tried to get me. I was just walking around, just doing my thing. <laughs> and then this little baby monkey, as I was walking mid stride, walked between my legs and I accidentally kicked it. <laughs> and he ran over to his mother and told on me. Start and screaming. then the mother. Like, Charged was at very him. unhappy. Like bangs and, and Luke starts running, which all of a sudden say, <laughs> Don't run. It was a scary monkey. <laughs> I mean, everyone freaked out. Everyone started running. <laughs> but he followed him for like 20 feet. And oh, then the, he followed, gave up. He followed me for like 500 feet. And every time <laughs> yeah, I would stop, he, he would keep Wait. running at me and baring his teeth. And it did not look like it was going to stop. So I just kept running and I thought this was about to be a horror story so I was trying to talk to her I was like yo chill I didn't mean it, it was an accident <laughs> she, she was, didn't understand she was not I, I was like, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, ooh, ooh. yeah but all is well moral of the story do not kick baby monkeys don't kick baby monkeys on accident no accidental baby monkey kicks so should you go to monkey forest absolutely totally <laughs> it was so awesome greatest experience have fun on your trip like subscribe and we'll see you next week